with the trim function in Excel, you can remove extra spaces from text, either at the beginning or at the end, and it will also reduce any spaces between the words to a single space if there are multiple spaces. So in the first example here, we've got a text string, and this is how it should look. There are no spaces at the start or end, and it's 13 characters, including those spaces. This is text that we've perhaps copied from a website or another document and pasted it into Excel, and now we can see there are 17 characters, so there are some extra characters, and it looks like there's a little gap at the beginning, so at least some of them are there. To trim that and fix it up, we can type an equal sign, T-R-I-M, for the trim function, an open bracket, and then click on the cell that you want to trim, close the bracket, and press Enter. And now we can see that the gap at the beginning is gone, so it cleared out spaces at the start and at the end, and we're back down to the original 13 characters. On this sheet, there are extra spaces between the words as well, so now we're up to 20 characters. And we would just use the same function again, trim, click on the cell that you want to clean up, and it's down to the 13 characters. It won't work on some spaces though. Perhaps you've copied something from a website. Now in this example, we can see a little gap before the first letter. We have 14 characters, but when I use trim, click on that cell, we're still at 14 characters. There is a non-breaking space that's used on websites and trim doesn't remove that. So I could manually go in and just highlight that first space and delete it, and that would take it down to 13 characters. But the trim function won't get rid of some of those strange characters for you.